Hey guys, welcome to Fire Emblem 9, Path of Radiance, Hard Mode, Iron Man Edition. Last time I fucking lost Soren. This time I'm gonna actually keep track of the clock and, you know, do some math to see if I have to leave mid-recording so I don't accidentally go almost an hour playing a game and not, like, what I thought was 40 minutes. Whoops. Hey, I heard you're leaving. Going to Benyon, eh? Hello, Rannell. I was hoping to see you. I want to thank you for everything you've done. I'd I'm glad I had the chance before I leave. Well, aren't you the dutiful one? Hey, that reminds me. You were born here in Gallia, right? I knew there was something off, something odd about you. You're awfully friendly for a Bjork, you know. Oh, you might not know, but a Bjork is what... I know what it means. It's what you call us humans, right? Oh, knew that, did you? Well, then, let me just... Let me tell you something else. We use your human. I mean, the same way you Bjork do when you call us subhuman. Really? It's an insult to be called human? I'm glad you told me. I would have never guessed. I should warn you, if you run across any Lagoos who call you that, be careful. They're no friend of yours. Got it, thanks. I won't forget it. But I've discussed long enough. Let me explain why I'm here. Also, the music, so it's not just birds. Please. Huh? Princess Alencia, may I have a moment of your time? Yes, of course. I think I asked that I give you this. Please accept it as a gift. What, may I ask? Then that letter pouch is 20,000 gold pieces. They are currency, of course. Oh, I truly appreciate this generous offer, but... Give this magnitude is not something I can accept. King Kanegas has done so much more than necessary already. I think it's a shame that he could not at this time provide any more personal support. Please, will you accept this apology and acknowledge his desire to aid you? But, no? Well, well then, let's try this. Yes? You accept the king's gift, then ask payment for conducting your... You stay with the galley, you hand it over to Ike. Um... I don't want to do that. <laughs> Just kidding. Come on, Ranulf. You can't expect her to accept this. It's an outrageous fee, no matter how you look at it. 20,000 gold for the life of a princess? Perfectly reasonable, in fact. Almost borders on insulting. Seeing how you suffered the lives you've lost, 10 no, 100 times this amount would be unreasonable. I, I've i reconsidered. Ding dong, your opinion is wrong, Alencia. In turn, I will present this to my Lord Ike. You will accept it, will you not? I, I will, thank you. No, my Lord Ike, it is I who must thank you. Yay! Forging money. Well, now that's settled, let's move on. Fortunately, we don't have any ships here in Gallia. If you find a ship that will take you to Benyong, you must certainly occupy the Crimea. There's no other way than we'll have to just risk it. No matter how cautiously you proceed, you're certain that you're running to Dane forces. Keep that in mind. I understand. It's too bad we're short on soldiers. Seriously. Oh my god, we're short on soldiers. So, that's not much we can do about that now. However, I'll review our supplies carefully before we depart. In regards to your personal problem, personnel problems. Ch -ch -ch, nothing personnel, kid. The king has decided to lend you what aid he can. Leith, Mordecai, I will join you. Mordecai and Leth, both of you, I'm sure. None of the others would stand the idea of traveling with humans. I myself tremble with loathing at the thought of going to Benyong, but when the king gives an order, obedience is his only option. That may be, but having witnessed the combat prowess of Galleons for myself, and how fortunate we are, he will not fail you. I know intent of becoming friends, do not forget that. It's staying on my way. <laughs> you must forgive Leith. Her tongue cuts as deep as her claws do. I will turn once to parts of the king. When I'm gone, while I'm gone, please finish your preparations for departure. Very well. Yeah, we got a lot of new allies, but Soren's gone. That's all I have to report. If you excuse me. All right, barrack time. Supports. Ooh, maybe maybe that Ike Titania one. I've never done that one before. That sounds pretty good. By the way. Um, if your units do die, like, for instance, I don't know, you get Soren killed, you lose the support, so you still have five combos left. I don't know, Rolf is pretty bad. Do I want to give him the missed support? I feel like I might, and if- Because she already has good ones. Maybe I'll save missed for later. Because, I don't know. Then again, Rolf, who the fuck else is going to support, I guess, right? Mmm, fuck it. Mmm. It's tough. This is a tough one. Either way, though, I think I'm going to do I Titania. Let's see that. Hey, I training? Yeah, you too, huh? Then you want to spar. I've learned a lot when you team up. Really, I'm glad to hear. I thought we needed a lot of me in my lessons. What are you talking about? You're the one who finished the pu put the finishing touches on what that swordsmanship I inherited from my father. Hm. I'm on here, you say so. I mean it. The talent you inherited from your father is one of a kind. I want you to cherish it. Huh? Hey, Titania, where do you meet my father? You used to be a Crimean knight, right? That's right. That's a long story we need to train. Get ready, focus. Fine. Let's just do Mist and Rolf. Why not? What's well, the worst case we'd kill Rolf? Rolf, oh, there you are. Mist, were you looking for me? Yeah. 
<laughs> Gotta talk. I don't want to hear voices and talking to each other back and forth. Pounding in the shape. I shot an arrow in a boy's backside. Wow, how? How do you do that? He died. Rip. <laughs> Maybe that's how he died. I don't remember. I think he got hit by an axe, though. <laughs> he was smacking. I'm so scared I heard yelling and screaming. Though dizzy and sick. I wasn't scared at all. Maybe I was a bit nervous. By the end, I was almost hitting my targets. Been a little scared? No way. I can wait for the next battle. By next time, you see. Something, something, yeah. Oh, we're all, we're all. Uh, whatever. Okay. Info. Actually, before that. So, we have a lot of award experience. Or bonus experience. I don't know what it says. Award experience. Um, now, I do believe that the furries require more. Well, let's just get this one off I missed. And I will probably... Well, I'll do the bonus experience shit off screen. I don't know how to dance a good level, though. But I have a few units I need to make good real quick. But I will get some of these info things in there now. Hmm. You there, Bjork. What do you think you're doing? I shouldn't get back to my room, but I lost my way. Tell me which way I need to go. It's this way. Follow me. Hey, not close. Walk behind me. What? Uh, pardon me. The king has orders to treat Bjork kindness, but... It'll take some time. It's difficult to fight that instinct. Perhaps I'm afraid the slavery our forefathers suffered at the Bjork hands flows in our blood. I understand. I'll keep my distance. Very well. Let's go. All right. See, he's not racist. Ike's a good boy. Ike ends racism. He's best boy. That's why. And so we put this guy over here, and this deadly dealy Bob is here, and we're finished. Packing, huh? Want some help? Do I want some? <laughs> You're a hoot, handsome. I'm already done. You're more skillful than this, I imagined. Or is that Miss Wolverine enough? Uh, the Benyon Pegasus Knights? We... What the fuck is their voice? <laughs> so I'm moving around, so I learn to pack quickly. You need to train us all the time. Go, he go here, pack this fun stuff. Is that so? Steve, a strong sense of duty quitting the Benyon Pegasus Knights to join us, but seem... What are you saying? I'm a burden now? Um, no. I'm very grateful you're here, and as I told you before, we're short on personnel. Oh, good then, and I'm happy to be here. Uh, say, Ike, uh, you don't need to worry about me quitting the venue on service. My decision was based solely on my desire to repay you. You had other reasons? Yeah, I'm, I'm also searching for, for Ma Makalov. He may be a adult and a scandal, but he's all the family I have in the world. Remember when you found me with fun those pirates? Well, I was trying to track him down. Every time I go looking for him, I'm in some dangerous situation with some ugly butt monkey trying to kill me. Hey, so that's why you decided to join us, is it? I can understand that. So, are you sorry you asked? No. <laughs> okay. You know, when we find Makalov, I guess we'll see. If I have a lot of units, I'll probably kill him. Because fuck Makalov, honestly. You seem racist. Look who I'm trapped with. Of course I'm racist. And I'm keep your worthless observations to yourself. All of you are so low. I can't believe you're still not ready. Sorry about that. But I like you and didn't need to carry anything. It'd be easier, but we have weapons and things to get ready. What was a seal or human weakness? Well, then we cannot fight properly. But, Leaf, you're carrying a dagger, aren't you? It's a scabbard on your leg. This is not for fighting. No, what's it for? I used to remove all small bones from meat. They also cut fruits of bite-sized pieces. It's proven quite useful. Hmm. What, you got something to say? Spit it out. You despise Bjork, but you don't mind Bjork crafted tools? Checkmate, liberals. <laughs> Just kidding. Although, that this totally is like... Oh, so you hate capitalism? Well... Oh. Do you own items? <laughs> it's the same shit. Something good, it's good. Then I think something's obvious, something's obvious worth out of petty spite is foolish. That's not I. I do not despise everything Bjork. Every Bjork could get along with us as well as you do, I'm certain. Leaf? That's a ridiculous conversation. I'm leaving. I like the little things here. I guess, oh yeah, I should probably mention, she goes with the Bjork card. I don't know if I did that. Yeah, half damage from Bjork. It's pretty good, especially... I mean, I'm getting, keep it on her, because Morkai is just made of fucking pure steel and beef. Anyways, I'm going to be back after I use some of my items to do some shopping. And... Alright, girl bosses, we are done with the things. I'll show off what I did after the fact. Hey, look at this. I will say, I do appreciate how in this we actually fill in the map as you go across the countries. Like, pretty cool detail. I don't know if I mentioned the first time around. I probably did, because I'm repetitive. And the son of father's death placed the mantle of leadership with young shoulders. I could agree as it continues Lindsay as escort. Also, the fact that it's like a stylized thing, like, you know, pretty radical. Company Hat Horse for the Benyon Empire, the oldest and largest nation of all time. Old Tellius, if you can't tell by how fucking huge it is. Also, minus this little chunk at the end over here, doesn't it kind of remind me of like Africa and Madagascar, or am I just insane? I don't know why. I've always seen Africa in it as a kid. <laughs> Just because, like, the shape of it. And it's currently for, for, for a fiefdom of Ben Yong. Princess turns them for, for Sikor. Much as a scared child returns to their parents. Many tell us believe it's not Ben Yong's might and influence. Kremia's reconstruction may be nigh impossible. However, Ben Yong and Galia have no thick ties and are further separated by an impassable mountain range. 
So the company is forced to return to Crimea, where they hope locate a ship to carry them to Benyon. And off they go. <laughs> With what looks like the most obtuse way possible, but it makes sense. Trust me, it makes sense. Yeah, it's my boy. Take it, that's Ike's new boyfriend, now that his old one's dead. <laughs> I've learned that I ran off. The warrior who volunteered to guide them. The company leads Galli Castle Galia behind. Heavy hearts and wounded spirits to begin the long march back to Galia. Crimea. Fuck. They're going to Crimea. They're leaving Galia. Hey, Ike. Hold up a moment. You know, since I was thinking, since the castle's in the way, we should probably stop by. Um, really? Why? Is there something special about this place? Why, yes, there is. This is Canada's path. Can't see his castle. Things seized it early on in the war. Now there's a camp for prisoners. You're gonna heard there are a number of Crimean retainers being held captive in the co dungeon beneath the castle. What? What? What the fuck? Princess, I'm her. Of course my relation information is reliable. If we can rescue some Crimean soldiers that might decide to join us, that would be quite a boon, would it not? We need more fresh bodies, Ike. Please. Yes, I think it would. It would be worth the risk. Wow, look at... Mm -mm, look at these units. <laughs> I need some of these. My army is very low. And we need you guys. Come on. Join our little army. That's such a sad army. Holy shit. <laughs> Question now is how do you open the cells to free the prisoners? Cells are certainly be locked, so in order to open them, Lodge would take the keys would be in the possession of the jailer. We have no choice but to steal them. If lucky the guards will have keys as well. In either case, we must move to caution. We don't want to trade blows with the entire castle garrison. If we just stay close to the walls and avoid being seen or heard, right? Alright then, our first priority is to get our hands on the cell keys. Hey, you there. Oh, well, look who it is. I have business with Sir Grail. Where is he? You're solely lacking in social etiquette, aren't you? State your business. I'll speak with Sir Grail and Sir Grail alone. Now, take me to him. What you ask is impossible. Commander Grail is dead. Well, th th that's a problem. Just who are you, anyways? Call me Volk. Sir Grail hired me. I'm in intelligence. My father hired you. You're Sir Grail's son, correct? You'll do. Sir Grail hired me to investigate something. You pay my price, and I'll give you my report. Deal? How much? 50000 That's a bit steep. And worth every penny. I don't have that much. Give me time. So you're willing to pay. My father hired you. He must have had a good reason. Are you sure, Commander? We have no way of knowing he's telling the truth. Let me see the contents of that report. Until then, let's have him chuckle with us. So that's your plan, eh? Listen, you'll get the report when I'm paid, and I'm waiting around until then. I'll give you information from time being. Call me when you got the gold. Stop at any tavern along your way. Tell the barkeep you need a fireman. You'll see me within an hour. Hold a moment. Intelligence. You say we're intelligence, right? Information is the only thing you sell. Come out with it. What are you saying? Locks. Can you open locks? Sure, 50 gold. You're going to have them open the cell doors? Is that wise? You only just met him. There's no way to trust him. Hmm. You can. You can just not hire him and just lose bulk, which has implications for the story. I've never done it, but I'm very curious what happens. Bulk, will you help us break into those cells? As long as they get paid, I'm not a complaint. Does any objections? I told you before, didn't I? You're the commander. If you decide on the course of action, I will but follow. Well, we got Volk. Righto, I'm off. Good luck on all that. What? Wait, what? You're not going to help us here? Let's I would like to have a job to do. Oh, John, you and you finished. Hmm, I see. Well, good luck to you then. Yes, and to you as well. Cheeky little fucker. <laughs> Sword, please look after Princess Lincia. As you wish. Soren hates to see them ru walk away, but he loves to watch them go. Anyways, um, okay. I want to bring, I don't one of them, I think. One or both. Do I drop Mia? I'm not going to lie, she's been under-delivering a little bit, but at least she had, okay. Let me view map. What is your defense? I know these are not, these are the weaker enemies, but 10. Um, what's your attack? 15. Okay. And that's with a good weapon. Okay. Okay. Okay, Mia. Sadly, I think this is your time to go. You might have expired, and same with Rolf. I mean, maybe I broke both of them, because I can. Uh, but I don't know. I feel like Rolf would be pretty funny, though, for this chapter. I'm not going to do it the, like, super bonus experience way, because I don't know how. But, and I feel like if I mess up, then I'm going <laughs> to... It's big fuck-up territory there. Oh, no, we'll just bring over them. Why not? One furry in the back because he needs to transform later. Actually, I'm going to bring Rolf because I want them to both be transformed at the beginning because that's going to be the tough part. All right, Leaf, congratulations. You're in the army. Now, there's two ways you can play. You can either stealth around, stealth around, unlock the things, and leave. Or you can brute force. 
I'm gonna brute force because I don't know how. Also, I forged a huzzah for Marsha. Um. Okay, what is your movement? Seven, one, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, I want to actually rescue up Sephirin too, because I can always use him as a you know a fresh body. Player phase. Hey, Leaf. Okay. Now you want to avoid getting in their range, is the big thing. Or in this case, I am just going to pop open the door. Fifty gold. I don't care. I can take it. All right, and then I'm gonna pick you up with Oscar. I'm gonna move everyone up a little bit, you know. Okay. Take drop. Go up here, because I do have, I do have a use for Sephirin. It's a silly use, but it's a use. But I want to keep everyone else alive. Like I don't want to disturb the guards. You, they won't detect you if you don't if you're not in their range. So just stay out of the range and you should be good. Now, I think the good way... If you want to do it stealthy-wise, you only need to bring, like, three units with you. But I'm not playing like that. Not today. So... Other phase. Hmm. Okay. Oh, uh, tell me something, will you? What's gonna happen to us? Those damn soldiers took my friends away. They never did come back. What, what did they do to them? Oh, I just know something bad happened. <laughs> I just know it. Quiet, fool. Keep your cowardly mutterings to yourself. It matters not what vile torture they devise. A true knight of Carmina is bold, steadfast, and strong. I cannot if they pull up my nails with tongs or just have pins of my soft flesh in my underbelly. Or yank. So stop it. I can't bear torture. I'm not a professional soldier. I'm just part of the militia. I can't believe I left my family behind for this. I'll never see them again. Oh, I want to go home. Curse. It's only the weapon of some sort. Help will come. I will not give up. Help will come. In fact, okay, let me just show off. Um, these are playable characters. Um, Braum, Kieran. Um, you want to save them. They won't join you this chapter. They'll just become yellow units. And then there's Sephirin. If you can't tell his stats, he means big business. He's also promoted a class and a bishop. He comes with a mantle, which greatly decreases damage done. He has an S rank in staves, and he has this Luminia thing. Which, if you can't tell, he's an important character. So, yeah... It's pretty cool to keep him alive. Well, it's pretty cool to keep him alive, but also you don't need to try, really. Like, he'll just do that for you. He's just that good. All right, I'm back again. Um, yeah, all I did off screen is because I forgot I was, I couldn't. <laughs> it was just not, I don't know what you call it, autopiling a little bit. Um, I moved him up here. What you call it, the Sephirin. Yeah, it's important. <laughs> It'll be important later, I swear. Although, I, maybe I'll just rescue up Ileana a little bit forward, you know? You know, it can't hurt to give her a couple extra... Little extra steps up there, you know? Alright. There we go. Keep going, keep going, I don't care. Alright, now I'm gonna trigger the... The reinforcements, I think, now. Um, what I'll do... Okay. I'll put Laron there. And the good thing, he's gonna body block for me. So, at least, like, that funnels in some of the enemies so they can't... So, like, at least from the north, they can't storm me. Because I know they will show up from this part, um, the right side, and then down there. But at least over here I can body block a little bit, you know. And now for these guys, uh, the Huzzah, I I super forged because I want to. So it's very good. But I think I do want to just cheapen it a little bit. Maybe get some pokes of Ileana. I don't want to use the forge immediately. Although it is very good. And just things escalate very quickly in this game. Look out, we're under attack. Form up, surround them all. Castle mill the defense has been breached. What are your orders, sir? Unfortunate timing, we're starting to lower the on prisoners. If you try to catch them alive, I'll have you try robbing me of my fun. As a command, sir. Yep, there they are. There they go. From all over the place. They've been spotted. Let's like do left, left to do but fight. Eh, we'll, we'll fight. We'll be perfectly okay here. 
we're not in harm's way regardless of the fact that a bajillion enemies just spawned i'm not in danger oh uh, actually maybe i can if i do kill with mar can kill with marcia here i did give her a couple levels so she's pretty good both experience wise marcia leveled up pretty great like i'm pretty happy with the results Dorky, yeah, she got um, she got some speed, she got some strength, she got some HP. Uh, Mist leveled up pretty good too. She got some stats that she needed. I don't remember what everyone got specifically, but they did good enough. Just, just have faith they did, I guess. Um, Oscar, stand here. I'll use a steel lance because you'll be fine. And I'm just gonna shove. Volk here just so I can grab Nephany pretty early. Which, yes, that is your girl Nephany, if you can't tell. She is one of my favorite characters. I don't know why, I just like her little shy demeanor and stuff, but like, she's not Bernadette shy where she's like, Aah! she's just like, you know, a little shy bumpkin. It's very adorable. So I will be using her. Is it optimal? No. Is it a bias? Absolutely, fucking lutely it is. All right. Also, I mean, I'm sure you guys have seen Heroes. Great art. Ow. Oh, did she one-shot with a forge? Damn, girl. Okay. Pop off, sis. All right. Well, this wasn't too bad, actually. Yeah. This was pretty good. Nice and simple, what we did. No damage. Yeah. They're not fucking with Sephirin. Although I'm now realizing that did literally nothing. Um. Okay. I will. Hmm. I don't want to take care of this. Because I'll do. I think I have enough time for one more turn. Because I realize you're not really a threat to me. Although maybe I can. St I don't know. If I can have Saffron just kind of take them and start shuffling them around so that they're easy to get at the end, that'd be nice. But if not, then I think it would just put Saffron in an unopportune place and forgot that they didn't move. Which is totally the... Which does more damage, by the way. The raw foe. Which I also think it gives you more... As more hit, and it gives you more weapon experience, so you want to use it. Like, it's a good weapon. Okay. Will Leaf just, just dominate? I forget how... How do furry gauges work? I think they're, like, the entire turn, right? So as long as she is, like... Yeah. So I think Leaf can just solo them. Damn. I swear, Lagoos are so good. Although, I do... I do need to get... Okay, can I get up to... You this turn? Yes. Because you, you need to talk to all of them. You're a Crimean soldier, right? I'll open your cell. Let's get out of here. Who are you? I'm Ike. I'm a mercenary group hired by Princess Crimea. Fill in the details later. For the time being, you just have to trust me. Very well. Ugh. Okay, that was just for fun. But, yeah, I want to... Well, I'm going to see how much damp... Uh, even that, I don't really do, the, do, do that, do I? Alright. Because I... I mean, Volk's pretty strong. Can you take Ike? You can steal from this man. What can you steal from this man? Nothing? Can you just steal the lance from him? No. Just there, because it's usually the typical prompt. Okay. Well, that's fine. Uh, Alright, Ileana. Don't get a crit. I'm okay with that. But as long as you chip him down enough, great. Ileana's great at chipping, honestly. Then I'm a-okay here. Uh, I do need the steel lance to nab this kill good there we go level up also volk is fairly tanky so like i'm not afraid of him not damn good level up oscar good good i gave him the talisman by the way because i just thought someone needed to use it and he was a pretty good choice and the reasoning i just thought it'd be neat seven plus five okay you won't you're not in danger okay that's good actually 
cannot endanger that means that I can give feed Rolf a kill. Okay, good. Perfect. And Rolf snags this. Nice. Do, 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 do. Oh yeah, I probably should start ordering Nefany out of there. But at the same time, though, she's the one that, you know, she's already kind of close to the exit. So maybe I should have not gone for Nefany first and gone for the other guys. Whoops. <laughs> That's you ever hitting Leaf. Come on, you can finally use your racism. You can take out all these Dane soldiers. Not a crit. Still good damage, though. I've never used Lether Mordecai, so I wonder how they'll turn out. Set up pure curiosity, like, you know. Anyway, she's just gonna wipe out this mob on her own, because Lagoos are just kinda like that. By the way, I don't have them, but there's you'll get Lagoo stone items. I know that Mordecai came with one. But they make it so the turn there's turns where when they're in just form they can do nothing. They can't even retaliate. So, like, those are kind of suck. Those turns kind of suck. But apart from that, you, you should be good, right? Like, the turns that she's good, she's good. The ones that she isn't, she's just kind of there. Although I do need her to escape. But she's... You can pick them up, though, when they're not transformed. And I don't know what their untransformed movement is. But, I mean, it should be fine enough. Alright. Oh, um, just... Yeah, just get the door. Or break it. No, I don't. Have, I don't know the doors' HPs. I don't want to mess with that too much. Yes, doors have HP in this game. Yes, it is silly. I will rescue Brahm a little bit up here, though. Uh, okay, Iliana. I can you get this kill? You can. Great, makes my job easier. So at least I don't have to walk as far with Ike, you know. Then I can have him and what's their they can target behind the uh, Sephirin, I guess. Alright, actually just rescue Sephirin, fuck it. Stand there. Because I'll just grab them next turn, right? Yeah, because Kieran's gonna be okay. Alright, you two, keep moving forward. Anyone take damage? Not really, no? Okay. This is a very clean run. Which is weird, because usually, I mean, I'm just used to... I'm just used to things going south. Although I will probably target... Nephany, go over here. Yeah. At least you can take the long way around while I'm still... Kind of trying to shuffle the rest of my units out. Alright. Untransform. That's a okay with me. Alright. You're from Crimea, right? Come on, we're here to rescue you. Now you open your cell. Now's the time to escape. Ah, it's you! Pardon? I never got a squint. That's Crimea, 12th Regiment. Your name is Oscar. And you're, wait a moment, you're Kieran, right? That's correct, I'm Kieran. The same Kieran who sworn himself to be your eternal rival. Uh, right. Kieran, so how have you been? He looks good. As always, your manners list is inappropriate. But if it's one who would call me a foe. You discharged three years ago. What are you doing here now? Ah, could it be you, dastard? Turning coat and giving to Dane, haven't you? Rumbles to the... With a spiggle, contemptible behavior. Unforgivable. Have you no shame? You were my true rival. Where's your pride gone? Mercenary Company of Attaches serves in the cri Command of Prince of Crimea. You're not free any... We came here to free any Crimean prisoners. The Prince of Crimea are not part of the Royal Guard. How do you know about the princess? Well, I guess to the person of our employer, and... Uh, that's your scheme, isn't it? He'll be skinned by, mer by emeritus, surge us and gain glory that is rightfully mine. Admit it. Look, my duty is... Blast you. Curse your name. Curse the name Oscar and all who call him kin. Never forget... I used to pass me, princess. I'm coming. Kin will be forever be at your side. Well, he's even more excited about our number. I believe he's actually east at night. And for recruiting Kieran, that is it for this episode. I will see you guys next time. Like, comment, subscribe. Bye, everyone.